I'm here with Jeff Madjinkalda, Chief Executive Officer for Coursera. Jeff, thank you for being with us today. And my first question to you is, how well have the University of London MOOCs gone down with the world since we first started five years ago? Well, the University of London has been one of the longest standing partners of Coursera. And I think one of the reasons it started so early is that we have such common alignment of purpose. The University of London is the people's university, and it's really all about access. And that's really the genesis of Coursera as well. So we started authoring courses very early on, and some of the best specializations in virtual reality and programming and web design have been taken on with great interest among our learners. And so we're very excited about what we've accomplished, and we're very excited about where we're heading in the future. Why do you think this partnership's been particularly successful? I think the partnership has been so successful because it started with a common purpose and alignment around what we're trying to accomplish. And that really is about access, providing access and economic opportunity to the full range of learners around the world, you know, not just those who were born into privilege. So we have a partnership that's predicated on common purpose. We have a lot of innovation happening. So it's also useful when two, two institutions really want to innovate and push the next boundary of creativity. And then, of course, the diversity of the member institutions of University of London provides a very wide range of possibility that we can really act on and, and take advantage of. You're now taking a very big leap forward with the introduction of the first undergraduate computer science program. How do you think that's going to go down? You know, it's always um, important to look at what is the demand for the types of services that you're creating. And as I look at the University of London, and I look at Goldsmiths College and, and the really creative and yet scientific approach that they take to a wide range of topics, it really seems like this degree in computer science is something that will meet the needs of many, many people around many parts of the world. The demand for computer science and the number of jobs that will be created for people who have technical skills is unprecedented. And the ability of Goldsmiths College to teach the world how to use computers and technology to provide opportunities in career, but also new services to serve the world, I think is a really wonderful opportunity. How much demand do you envisage for this degree? And what is the likely student profile uh, that you're expecting? We expect there to be quite a bit of demand for this degree. Partly is because if you look at employers around the world, there is a, a substantial imbalance between the demand for computer scientists and the availability of computer scientists. So on, on the demand side, I think there's going to be tremendous uh, opportunity. On the supply side, many people who could be excellent computer scientists have been either shut out or effectively shut out from this whole world of career opportunity. And because the University of London and Goldsmiths College is designing this for anybody with a high school diploma, and especially focusing on making it accessible and relevant to women and other people who otherwise might not have thought of themselves as computer scientists, I think there's going to be a whole opportunity for people to enter the world of technology jobs that otherwise might not have had such an opportunity. Where in the world do you think this degree will be particularly well received? You know, I think that the demand for computer science really goes around the world. The opportunity to get an education in computer science is not so available around the world. I suspect that there will be especially interest in parts of the world where the opportunity to get this kind of a degree hasn't really existed. And making this accessible and, af and affordable to women and other types of folks who haven't thought about or had the training in computer science is one of the most promising aspects of this degree program. What in your view makes this degree program unique? I think it's a combination of the technology that Coursera brings in its platform and the magic and personality that the professors and the academics themselves will bring to the way that they teach it. Another important part of this as part of a long tradition of distance learning, University of London and Goldsmiths College have a very wide uh, distribution and teaching network that allows us to bring not only digital but also on the ground experiential learning to the equation. So it's not just digital, it's really combining the best of both worlds and we're very excited to see how this shapes up. What measures have you taken to make this degree accessible to people all over the world? Well, we've worked a lot with the University of London to think about what will it take to make this program accessible. And of course, although there's a lot of demand for computer science jobs, there's different levels of wages and income around the world. 
and there's different resources that people can put to bear in training themselves and getting an education. We think it is absolutely critical that the pricing of this degree program really reflects the different means that people have around the world to pay for this kind of a degree. And that's why we're making pricing variable based on where people are in the world so that the access is universal. What's it been like working with the academics at Goldsmiths University of London throughout the course of producing this online program? Well, so far it has been thrilling to work with the academics at Goldsmiths. I personally have been learning uh, about music theory, I've been learning about the piano, and I've been composing music, and I've never met a group of people who are so diverse in their passions and their interests. And so one of the neat things about Goldsmiths College is that they bring a very scientific approach with a certain creative passion to this. So I think what we're going to be doing with this computer science degree is going to be filled with art as well. How do you see Coursera's relationship develop with the University of London over the coming years? We are really excited about where we might be heading with the University of London. This is our first degree program with one of the member institutions of the University of London and we have great aspirations to do many, many things. Our intention was to find a project that we think could be very successful, but from here we hope to do many, many more degree programs with many other member institutions at University of London.